Alcohol Detector Alarm An alcohol detector is a sensitive device, which is able to detect the presence of alcohol molecules, or any similar volatile inflammable element in the air, and convert it into equivalent level of electrical output. The simple alcohol detector circuit discussed here, will accurately sense the emanation of alcohol gas, from a selected source, such as from the mouth of a drunkard when used as a breathalyzer. It's a cheap and useful device, which can be used by all authorized personnel, such as a corpse, or traffic police, for nabbing drunken drivers or miscreants. In this project, we will learn, how to make an alcohol detector alarm, using LM358IC, and MQ3 alcohol sensor. These are the components, which are needed in this project. One comparator IC, LM358, 8 pin IC base, 2 10 kilo ohm resistors, 1 kilo ohm resistor, 10 kilo ohm, variable resistor, 2, 10 microfarad, electrolytic capacitors, 1 red LED, 7805 voltage regulator, 1 buzzer, alcohol sensor MQ3, 9 volt battery, PP3 battery connector, on off, rocker switch, 1 0 PCB, 4 screw with nuts, and 4 plastic spacers. Before making the project, we will understand its circuit diagram. This is a 9 volt battery, to power up the circuit. This is an on off switch, which is used to start or stop the project. This is a power supply indication LED. This is a current limiting resistor, to protect the LED from high current and voltage 7805 voltage regulator is used to convert 9 volt dc into fixed 5 volt dc while we use the circuit the battery starts discharging and battery voltage starts decreasing but 7805 maintains fixed 5 volt dc at its output unless the battery voltage goes below 7 volt two capacitors of 10 microfarad each are used at input and output of 7805, to avoid any fluctuation in power supply. LM358, is an 8-pin dual comparator IC. It compares two of its inputs, and give the output accordingly. Comparator compares the signal, at its pin number 2, with the signal at pin number 3, and gives the output at its pin number 1, when the voltage at pin number 2, is higher than the voltage at pin number 3. Then it gives a low output, at pin number 1, when voltage at pin number 2, is less than the voltage at pin number 3, then it gives a high output, at pin number 1, two 10 kilo ohm resistors, are used in potential divider mode, and they gives 2.5 volt, at pin number 2 of the comparator, this is the symbol of alcohol sensor, pin number 3 of IC is connected with the output of alcohol sensor. When sensor detects the alcohol, then it gives 5 volt at pin number 3 of comparator. Now, comparator have 2.5 volt at pin number 2, and 5 volt at pin number 3, so it gives a high signal. At its pin number 1, a buzzer is connected at pin number 1. So when alcohol is detected, then the buzzer starts beeping. When there is no alcohol, then this 10 kilo ohm resistor, gives the ground signal, at pin number 3. Now in this case, comparator have 2.5 volt at pin number 2, and 0 volt at pin number 3, so it will gives a low signal, at its pin number 1, and buzzer will keep silent. These components will be used, to make the circuit. First of all, we will make a PCB base, and for that, we will take a zero PCB, and make a hole at each of its corner. Now, we will insert a 1 inch screw, inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer, and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer. Now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB. Use a permanent marker, to make the outline on the PCB. Use the tweezer, to make the hole in the PCB. Use the cutter, to cut the plastic. 
Now insert the switch inside the hole. Now we will solder the 1 kilo ohm current limiting resistor. This resistor will protect the LED from high voltage and current. Now we will solder the power indication LED on the PCB. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Small pin of the capacitor is negative and long pin is positive. Now we will solder 7805 voltage regulator. It has three pins. First one is input pin, second one is ground pin and third pin is output pin. Now we will solder the 10 microfarad electrolytic capacitor. Now we will solder the 8 pin IC base. Now we will solder the MQ3 alcohol sensor. This sensor has 6 pins, 3 pins on the left side, and 3 pins on the right side. Short the two upper pins of left side, with each other, and connect it with pin number 8 of IC base. Now connect pin number 8 of IC base with 5 volt power supply. Now connect a 10 kilo ohm resistor between the first pin of right side and pin number 4 of IC base. Now connect the second pin of right side with pin number 4 of IC base. Now connect the joint of first pin of right side and 10 kilo ohm resistor with pin number 3 of IC base. This is a buzzer. Buzzer has two terminals, positive and negative. It has a sign of plus on its top. It shows that this side is positive and the other side is negative. Connect the positive pin of buzzer with pin number 1 of IC and connect the negative pin of buzzer with the ground supply. Now we will solder the variable resistor. It has three pins. We will use the middle pin and any one of the two side pins. Now we will solder the 10 kilo ohm resistor. Connect one terminal of 10 kilo ohm resistor with the variable resistor and second terminal with the ground. Connect the joint of variable resistor and 10 kilo ohm resistor with pin number 2 of IC base. Connect the second terminal of variable resistor with 5 volt power supply. Connect pin number 4 of IC with the ground supply. Now we will solder the PP3 battery connector. Connect the red wire with the positive terminal and black wire with the negative terminal in the circuit. Now plug the IC on the IC base. Now give the power supply to the circuit and check its functioning. Our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website 
www.eraltech.com you can give us the orders on whatsapp also thank you so much